What is going on YouTube fam? Welcome back to the Organized Millennial. Today I am coming back at you guys with a grocery haul. As you guys can see, I grabbed quite a bit of stuff um, from Market Basket. It's the first time I've been since I got paid, which was on the 30th, 31st maybe I went. Um, and I said in my last grocery haul, I'm not going back until the next time I get paid. So this was it. So let's see what goods I got. Also, groceries are too damn expensive. That is all. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for coming to my, my TED Talk. Um, so I got this lactate gallon of milk. Um, it's 2%. This is what we always get. So I got one of those. I got a pound of onions because I use them to cook quite a bit. I got these flavor mix chips um, and we are doing a little barbecue this weekend and by little I mean there's gonna be like four of us. Um, so it'll be little and it'll be very socially distant so I got some snacks for our guests um, with these and this was like parents that buy these for their kids, kids for like lunch. It's like eight bucks this thing like holy crap. <laughs> Anyways, so I got that um, and it brings 18 bags. And then I got some broccoli because I definitely want us to increase our veggie intake. So I did try to get um, some more veggies in this haul. So I got broccoli, um, which I've been using for stir fry lately. I got this spring mix that you see here, which is like your spinach, arugula, things like that for salads. Um, I picked up these two yellow squashes. Um, these were organic because they were the only ones that they had um, because we're going to be grilling and I actually love grilled zucchini and grilled squash. It's like my favorite grilled vegetable, I think. I still have many grilled vegetables to try, but I got those for the grill. This is um, two zucchinis over here in the corner. So I got those for the grill too. I got a couple sweet potatoes because I have a recipe that I want to use them for. These are like falling off. Like this food like barely fits you guys. I got some bananas. I got a couple of loaves of frozen garlic bread. So I like to have this when we have pasta. I'll have pasta, some garlic bread, and some type of side salad. So I'll probably use that spring mix for that. Um, so I got two of these. So we have plenty of pasta things. I got hot dogs, of course, for the barbecue. I just got the Market Basket brand ones. Your girl wasn't trying to do anything fancy up in these streets. Um, I got some tomatoes. I actually didn't realize they were organic tomatoes, but I'll take it. There are some normal tomatoes for my salads. Um, I got these stoplight peppers, which is what Market Basket calls them, because obviously they look like a stoplight. So I got two of these um, because I like to like caramelize my onions and peppers and put it on top of burgers and on top of hot dogs. Like I'm going all out, you guys. This is the first time we're grilling, which I realized it's only the, what, mid-June, almost mid-June. So there's still plenty of summer left, but I've been wanting to grill forever. So, <laughs> so I might've gone a little overboard, maybe. Um, obviously I'll use, I'll use it for that, but I'll also use it to cook um, for us. So. Um, I got some storage resealable bags because we ran out and I store lots of things in there, meats, um, used up veggies sometimes. I got some paper plates for the barbecue because those are just easier to dispose of. Um, I got a loaf of my favorite bread, you guys know, Country Kitchen, split top wheat is where it's at. Um, I got some seasonings, we actually ran out of the chicken bouillon so I got some of that, I got a pack of that, and I got a pack of sasson, which we're actually still pretty good on, um, but I was like, you know what, as long as I'm grabbing it, let me grab both so I don't have to restock on them. Um, I got a couple cheeses, so I got Swiss cheese for like sandwiches and stuff, and then I got some pepper jack cheese for the burgers. Obviously, you can still use Swiss for the burgers too if you want. I don't like American cheese, you guys. My boyfriend thinks I'm insane, and I'm like, listen, American cheese is gross. <laughs> so I'm sorry for all of you guys who like American cheese. I just told off your cheese. I apologize, but I do not like it. So I got those two. 
I got um, a pack of coffee filters. This has 500 filters, so I hadn't bought these in forever. We literally, I think, have two left, and I was like, oh, I guess I should buy it, so this will last for a very long time. Um, I got burgers, of course. We got some beef patties for burgers for the cookout, so I'm super excited for the weekend, and it's only Monday, y'all, so it's gonna be a long week. Um, I got these hash brown patties. You guys know that I love these. Um, I'm actually going to have some now. It is 9.15 a.m. I got up super early to go grocery shopping and your girl's starving and hasn't had coffee. So <laughs> I apologize in advance for anything I may say. I apologize, I apologize for anything I said before coffee or when I was hungry, um, which is right now. So um, I got these scoops, these chips. Um, I got fruit snacks. I love fruit snacks. Um, and I've been trying to get less like sweets and like cakes and stuff like that. So I decided this was pretty good option, pretty good substitute option, I guess. So I got the big pack of these. Um, I got this Kerrygold butter, which I need to put in the fridge really soon. And I got this to make um, chocolate chip cookies. And I might try some chocolate peanut butter chip cookies too, but that's just between you and me. I haven't told my boyfriend that. <laughs> Um, I got cream cheese. This is for my boyfriend, really, to go with his bagels that I got him. You guys will see those in a sec because he loves that stuff. I am not a bagel person at all. Um, let's go up here. I got some soy milk. Um, I like to drink this for smoothies mostly. This is what I put in my smoothies. So if you guys, you guys might have missed this video, but I ordered Shakeology, which is basically a powdered nutritional drink kind of thing and I like to make it with milk um, but I like to make it with soy milk or like almond milk I don't like to make it with regular milk so I got this one for that and then I got this coffee called El Pilon or Pilon um, which I've actually never tried but have seen many places um, and I I want to say it's pretty similar to Cafe Pistero so um, I got two packs of shredded cheese. So this is just finely shredded and this is a little more, um, it says finely, but they are a little bit thicker. Um, and this is for um, eggs. I usually put it on top of eggs and also for a um, dish that I want to make and tacos. So I use this for quite a bit of stuff. Sorry for the shadowing, you guys. I'm trying to make it so that there's not so much shadowing. Um, and then this is a tablecloth that I'm going to use for our table outside for the cookout. Then if we go down here, we've got some olives because we ran out of those. I got some mustard, of course, and ketchup for the barbecue, hot dog bread, and then underneath are onion bagels, two packs of onion bagels for my boyfriend. And that stuff is not a part of the haul. So that's this side. Now we're gonna mosey on over to the other side. Okay, so on this side, I know you guys, this is a pretty big haul for me. Um, I got two packs of curly fries because we're gonna have burgers and dogs left over. So one day we can just have that and fries and call it a day. Um, the back, there's a vanilla soy milk. And this one I got because I have chia seeds and I wanna try making chia seed pudding, which I've had before is amazing. <laughs> I don't know if I can make it as amazing as the ones I've had, but I'm certainly gonna try. So. That is what the vanilla soy milk is for. Um, I got milk chocolate chips. I don't like dark chocolate, so I actually make it a point to get milk chocolate chips for the cookies that I plan to make. So two cups of those. And I also got these peanut butter chips that I'm gonna use for the peanut butter cookies um, that I make at some point. And then right behind that, there is Skippy. So I got two jars of peanut butter. One is creamy and one is super chunk. My boyfriend likes the crunchy. I like the creamy. Compromise. Um, and then this wasn't really a part of the grocery budget, but it's the only real personal item or toiletry item that I got. And it's just, um, just like a shower gel or body wash and it's sweet suckle and orange and it smells fantastic. <laughs> um, then I picked up a couple of bottles of this less sodium soy sauce to use for stir fry 
and I got this teriyaki sauce as well for stir fry. Um, we've been getting into stir fry lately because it helps us eat more vegetables because I can throw pretty much any vegetable I want in there with whatever protein and we usually have it with some white rice. So it's been a good go-to to switch it up. Um, so I stocked up on that stuff for that. Um, I got a couple of sponges because ours is like ready. It's like on its deathbed pretty much. It's ready to go. So I grabbed a couple of those. I got this avocado salsa. So I saw a commercial for this and I was like, I have to try this because as y'all know, I love me some avocados. So I finally got this. I'm excited to try it. Um, and I will let you guys know how I feel about it. Um, and then right behind it, or right under it, I should say, is this raspberry iced tea. This is pretty much the only drink that's not water that we have. Um, I will probably get some type of drinks for the cookout, but um, I didn't get them this trip, so. And then finally, we have our um, dozen and a half of eggs. So I got two of those because we fly through eggs. I'm also gonna be baking cookies. So I wanted to make sure we were equipped with eggs. So that is it, you guys. Let me pan you guys back to the other side. Crazy but true. We got so much stuff and now your girl needs to go and put all this stuff away and feed herself some breakfast before she loses her damn mind. Um, but before I go, <laughs> grab my receipt. So I spent a grand total of $178.81 at Market Basket. So it was a pretty hefty haul, you guys. I got quite a bit of things. Um, yeah, it's, yeah, it was, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot for sure. Anyway, so that was my haul, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and smash that like button if you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe for more budgeting, planning, and life content. It's been real. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.